<laughs> Guess who's home, baby? You guys don't realize this, but this pink shirt that I wear. Yeah, the rub them if the you rub love them. The rub them if you love them. This is a cancer shirt. Didn't know that. Didn't know that, did you? I'm dumb. Yeah, you do. It's okay, but where are we at, Frank? We're at DNR Customs, obviously. And we put it out to the universe a short time ago. I said this. We're gonna try to convince him to sponsor us a diesel burnout truck. Fact. Yeah, that's the plan. And the universe has spoken. The universe has brought us something. <laughs> Well, did the universe bring it or... Oh, actually, yeah, yeah. I mean, the universe and Derek. <laughs> Derek yeah, yeah. Who is part of the universe? This All things very, considered. Very facts. Yeah. We should uh, we should go check out what the universe brought us. <laughs> I'm so excited. Early rendition. Yeah, let's go. Suspect. That is suspect, Frank. You know it's coming. <laughs> okay. Where could it be? Where could it be? We know that red one. Is it the red one? I don't think we can afford the red one. Here. We're gonna surprise us out front with the truck. I don't know what it's gonna be. <laughs> it's gonna be something. <laughs> it's gonna be a burn. Is it a burnout Cummins? A Bummins? A Bummins? Is it a burnout Ford? Mm. A board? Is it a Lincoln MKT? I don't know. <laughs> I hear something coming. I hear something coming, dude. Look at this. This is probably where it was probably parked at one point. <laughs> oh! Yes, dude. She's a beast. Oh wait, not this again. <laughs> Oh, it's got brakes. Hey, the brakes hey it does have brakes. Dude! Where do we found you? This might be too nice. I know. It could be too nice. That's a newer box. Yeah, what the hell, dude? It's already got a little bit of evidence of something here. Yeah, you know. All right, what are we looking at here, Derek? We are looking at this fine piece of machinery here we found uh, in somebody's backyard. <laughs> You ain't spooling, you're drooling, baby. <laughs> Went almost all the way down here to Pennsylvania to find it. Oh boy, yeah, okay. Right. It was literally right, uh, right on uh, Youngstown, right? Which is, you know, basically Ohio, Pennsylvania, PA border. And, oh yeah. Oh, yeah, and um, some dude said it didn't run. I was like, all right, how much? He's like, four grand. Okay, four grand and doesn't I'm seem like, bad. All right, bad. no 6 -0, no start. No big deal, right? So literally I had to send the dude PayPal money and uh, made it happen because he's like, yeah, another guy blowing up his phone and I'm like, I'll be there in the morning. Classic tactic, dude. Yeah, I got someone get coming. Done. Get her yep, done. We, uh, <laughs> me and my buddy Pete, we rolled out Sunday morning and here she is. I mean, it didn't run. We got a little bit of work to do. Um, I'm thinking a couple days, the old guns will have her running back at the shop. She's got low side oil pressure. So the guy said it was running last Thursday. Um, I don't know, I've seen worse, so. We're in a real nice neighborhood. It was a uh, real upscale where we, <laughs> where, uh, <laughs> you know, we wanted to get in and get out, uh, yeah. Yeah, I bet, I've been in situations like yep. that before. But it's got a clean, clean title, so we're good. Yep. Does it? Yeah, I, th I think <laughs> so. Does it have a title at yeah, least? Yeah, no, we got it, yep, signed off from, I don't know who, but it's, there's- Someone. It, yeah. I remember when these came out, I loved these wheels. So know, the fact yeah. that it has those wheels yep. is tight. I bought a 601 time and, I get there and they had a spare in the back corner and I was okay. like, are you kidding me? Yeah. yeah. So mad because I didn't get the other wheel. Sorry, man. Now so I have, now we have. Yeah, someone's got them. Yeah. Uh, wow, okay, it looks pretty decent. Yeah, it's not terrible. I mean, for for the budget we had to work with here and like just it's, the time frame. It's actually straight. Oh, the broken arm reveals itself. Uh, okay. Look, it, it looks like there's some issues. Evidence of something. Had, had what are we looking at here, Derek? Uh, we're looking at your average uh, <laughs> six liter that comes in with a few hundred thousand miles on her and she, you know, some, uh, some other people have had their hands in it. So, uh, yeah, um, we had a crank no start, which is pretty common for when they come through the shop. And okay. So I made sure we had low side oil pressure and I knew that means the lifter didn't go through, you know, lifter didn't blow out and go through low side pump and the motor's junk, so. Oh, that's good. Yeah, yeah, great. Um, yeah, literally we fixed it for, I don't know, about... 75 cents in parts. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Uh, happens. Yeah. On these 6.0 jobs. Dang. So what was blown on it? Um, uh, O-ring on the high pressure pump and the Fickham fuse. What is Fickham? Uh, the fuel injector control module, it's kind of hanging out under there. Oh, it basically okay. supplies all the voltage to the injectors, tells it what to do. Where is our air filter? 
Oh, we don't need one. No? See, no. these people, don't, no. they don't run air filters. When yeah, are you gonna learn this? This is soon, easier, so when we, you know, if it's, if it's struggling, we're way up in elevation or something, we can just crack the bottle and get them back wheels spinning a lot easier. <laughs> way up in elevation? <laughs> we're gonna be going back to Idaho with this. Yeah, yeah. Look at all these numbers, they, they did a lot of stuff here. Yeah, so is that Mike it, Jones it had 150,000 yeah. miles on it, but then I started to compute, well, the hood's got 250 there, 260, yeah. 268, oh. and then I found a, a um, a different cluster behind the back seat. So I think I think we might have got <laughs> snookered a little bit, but it's all right. It's kind of a, I don't know, it's a, it's kind of a mess because it's an 05, so it's got, but we found it's got an early pump in it. They got, basically the motor's been out of it. So like, oh, okay. it's, but not really a big deal. I don't, we don't want this to be like a one and done project for right. you guys. So yeah, so Derek, why are we choosing a six liter? Like, yeah, this is a great the question. Junk motor in the whole world. Like why do we want this one? Oh man, I mean, a bit of backstory, I guess, real quick, is like a six liter for me, it's got a little motion attached to it. Like, yeah, honest to God, it's kind of what took my business almost like 13, 14 years ago from the backyard to commercial. Oh, okay. Is, you know, yeah. these things were just notorious for failures, head gaskets, this, that, and the other. And um, AJ started working for me damn near 13 years ago, and we fixed a lot of them. I mean, and we, you know, we did well out of them, and um, made, you know, made a name for ourselves within, within the community. And we just never were really big into like making them go fast. Like we had some seven, eight hundred horsepower ones, but like these things are not that bad. They're a dime a dozen. They're cheap. Um, you know, if if we if we chuck a rod out the engine, who cares? We'll get another one. You know what I mean? If trans blows. 300 bucks we'll go to junkyard and get another one or we oh, can damn. build it you know okay. what i mean like and we got a bunch of spare parts um you know why is it better than a cummins cummins drops an injector you're done like it's park that thing this thing drops injector it don't care just keep going it's got seven more it's got left, seven dude. more she'll, she'll stay lit huh? <laughs> yeah it don't matter good okay. that's what we like to hear yeah because it, it's gonna be needing to stay lit frank yeah. judging yeah. by what you're gonna do to this right. sucker yeah yeah no problem should we so, check out the interior i kind of want to see what it's like in there pretty like pretty. You're gonna be living in this thing for a little while, Frank. I'm fine with that. I like the handle. Okay. Right. Oh, dude, it ain't even bad. It's not even bad. Got some new part lights, you know, people love those. <laughs> it looks like the, the headliner's made of a marshmallow. It's all good. What do we got in here? Anything in the, the right CD stuff. player? Oh, shoot. It's four wheel. Oh, well, yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah, and it's mechanical. Yeah. So we can just, so we can just... the request, right? So I guess. Drive, so I that's like know. another gear we can grab. We'll start. We'll start, right? Oh yeah. Well, I don't. We had a crank <laughs> hot nose start the other day. I don't see if it'll start. Okay. We'll do it. I'll... No, you gotta crank it, bud. Yeah, crank, crank it, bud. Crank it. Crank crank it. it. So it starts. Oh yeah. Oh, okay. No big deal. A couple little lights here. No biggie. Sounds good. It actually seems super responsive. <laughs> it's pretty responsive. Look at this sucker, dude. Okay. You got something going on, don't you? You're feeling uh, it. Are you feeling it? I'm feeling it. It's not even cracked, dude. Right. Dash is good to go. Ford. Ford, tough. baby. Built Ford tough. Ah. What the hell happened here? Okay, diamond plate. Yeah, is, is this green? Is that If that's green, I am that colorblind because I see blue. It's blue. That looks like green to me, boys. Oh, yes. Work. Well, that's kind of good considering... Yeah. What we're gonna do with this, you don't even know about <laughs> what we're planning on calling this oh. sucker. Oh, okay. Did I tell you? No. Okay. I don't even we'll know. We'll maybe that. save that for another day. Yeah. What else we got what back is here? That? Is that torque wrench up there? That'd be sweet. No. Dang it. Look at this bed though. I mean, it's nice. Well, this is a newer bed. Yeah, yeah. The these, bed's not even dude, a bad these bed. These beds go for like 2,500 bucks all day long. What? Yeah. This bed probably. Yeah, with yeah, no tailgate. Bed. With no tailgate. Yeah, with no That's tailgate. probably why it's a different tailgate on here. 2,500 bucks? So this is the. Joshua, no way! <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. How do you get? Okay, is that is that a joke or is that real? No, like I, people drive around cash yeah, for junk. Yeah, cash for junk. Like, and this, in this real I thought it was like a cash for clunkers thing. This upscale thing. neighborhood we were in, it, I mean, that's what they do. Okay. Oh, you're saying like they pick up your junk. Yeah. I was thinking cash for clunkers, like the thing yeah, where no, you could trade no, in no, your, no, no, uh, no, no, okay. No. Yeah, but no, this bed is a newer one. See this? Yeah. Oh yeah. This has got, uh, you know, def Provision hole. for def. But we ain't got no def in this old unit. Oh, good. Should we see if it drives? <laughs> yeah. I'm over here learning so much about this stuff, Frank. Yep, you're gonna have dead cylinders and they still just keep rocking. Like, yeah. That, that's why 6.0 is the way to go. Doesn't There's sound right. A lot right. of people saying that's not the case, dude. I, I, I don't know. I understand it, but 
once they see it, they'll get it. <laughs> Not jacked. And he just told us the list of parts that's coming. We'll have to go over that a little bit. Oh my gosh. Yes. Yeah, we got some parts coming from Fleece. Oh. Whew. I like that. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Hey, it still works. I like it. I'm excited to go for a little ride. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Let's save the blow up till later. Oh, it comes with a free high vis vest, dude. Oh yeah, we can throw that right back here. <laughs> Actually, we should put it over the seat. So all the construction guys, that's what they do, you know, they put them over the seat. So it looks like there's another person in the seat, so they go down the HOV lane. Oh man, we're calling them straight out. Hey, oh, and there's a receipt in here too. Oh, we might need that. Yeah, I don't think we could turn this in, but what do we got? Big Apple Supermarket in Youngstown, Ohio, dude. Doing a little fill up here, dude. <laughs> On a way to do a test ride. <laughs> That's what we need. We need our own fuel tank, dude. Uh, we actually have a thousand gallon fuel tank at the farm. Well, thank you. Yeah, we just gotta <laughs> put fuel for, in it. Uh, do you guys want me to do the windows? Yeah, yeah. Get okay. the windows, top off the fluids. We yeah. could use some washer fluid too. Yep. Might need some oil too. Okay. It, is, it is a six liter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude. What <laughs> we got here? Money. The best part about getting a new vehicle is looking through it, especially when it's something that clearly no one cared about. Right. Uh, what they buy here, dude? Something, something. Ten bucks. I'm Couple going to bet that change. they had a problem with some fuses. You know, it would seem as if there was a fuse issue. And he said the Fickham blew a fuse. Yeah. Was it happened to be one of these mini fuses? Yeah. Because there's a bunch of them in yeah, there. Yeah, we just put a thirty in it. Would it have a ten? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Good for the wire. Drop a thirty in her and call her a day. Well, you ready to take it for a ride? <laughs> it's kind of nice, dude. I mean, we don't have a tow vehicle. Yeah. Have you ever making a burnout toy that could be our tow vehicle. <laughs> it doesn't feel How good. How hard is this? It doesn't feel good. Wow. It's right. <laughs> it's a nice truck. Oh, crap. Come on. Oh. <laughs> Keep that shut. What do I got here? Oh, what is that? An old donut bag? <laughs> oh, is that blood? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Get her. Jeez. Oh. <laughs> Jeez, what dude. What is that? More fuses and uh, a relay and a fuse puller and a giant fuse. Nice. Uh, yeah. yeah. We'll see on that. Four to six days later. All right, we're out here in uh, Mexico. A little burnout. <laughs> One side of fire. Bump it. Get them both going, Frank. There we go. She's ripping, dude. Bone stock. Oh, yeah. Nice. Nice. Okay. <laughs> It'll do a burnout, though. <laughs> Hey, it works. We got that going for us. Oh, they got a little sticky too. Shoo! Frank, you did it. Derek. Oh. Yeah, not that bone stock. Normally, though. I can get a truck to pivot in the middle of the road. It didn't work. All right, next time, I promise it will. <laughs> <laughs> Let's drive this thing back. I feel so bad because it's actually pretty nice. It is a pretty nice truck. Yeah, it does, like, the, the brakes feel good, like it drives nice, it ain't all hey, whopped out. So, in respect to our Mexican farmers, I'd like to kick that dirt pile back we'll get there her, a little bit. Well, we'll get, it, we'll get it back, we'll go over there, take care of that. Oh, he's kicking the dirt pile back, what a good guy. <laughs> we need a POV of the burnout here, oh. bud. Oh, oh! <laughs> gonna go in a stock truck and it's gonna leave not stock <laughs> not stock at all we gotta go over what we're gonna do to this sucker because yes, there's a lot 
I mean, all things considered, what is this, a Falcon Wild Peak? We could use those for our first burnout tires for sure. They're definitely still. Yeah. Well, I mean, they're probably going to be gone by the time we are, we, put, are we putting that out there now? We need some. All the practice uh, We might need some. Yeah, we need some tires. Some 18s, you know, and we've got some decently. Used. Well, dude, we'll get them. We'll get them. Is this the is last this time we're looking at some of this stuff? Oh. So, what are you doing right. to this sucker, well, Derek? Not bad. I mean. You're looking for coolant pressure? Yeah, she's all right. Still, still holding in there. It's still there. Yeah, so uh, AJ here. Hey, AJ. How's it going? He's, um, I don't work on six liters. I'm not going to lie. I never have. I know, know a lot about them. Just don't really, you know, get in there. So AJ's pretty much one man band. On, uh, AJ, back in the day, built a, what was it, junkyard twin turbo? Yeah. I mean, what? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Twin turbo 6.0? Yes, sir. Dude, we got the right guy in the job. Yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> so we're going to, um, I guess the quick overview plan here is we're going to kind of, we're going to get rid of the degas bottle. We're probably going to put aluminum radiator in it. Okay. Um, that way it just takes off, gives us some more room to work. Get rid of the um, heater core, all that stuff. Well, that we're not going to have heat, Frank. No. It's going to be hard turning into our daily driver if you do all that stuff. Yeah. Well, that's the purpose here. Frank will still daily drive it for <laughs> oh, sure. Oh, we know, yeah. Uh, pull the engine out, um, put some O-ringed heads on it, go through it, reseal everything so that way it isn't <laughs> pissing oil everywhere. You say O-ringed heads? <laughs> yeah. Well, the, the trick is we're going to try to keep the coolant in so. oh yeah yeah smart. But, yeah i mean it, it we got some parts coming for some uh from some uh sponsors that i've had over the years that are going to kind of help out with this as well so yeah we yeah. already said something about that we'll yeah we'll, we'll keep that you know like we'll, uh, a little cotton candy spare maker in there is yeah. gonna be a little bigger i mean we already got one of them but oh yeah we're gonna you get, say a bigger one bigger one yeah so a little okay. lighter wheel yeah we're gonna do some uh, mods to the injectors some stuff that we've been doing for like 10 years we're gonna kind of so you can do like the blue spring mod and then the spacer and stuff that goes under it is that what you're doing yeah, that's like a couple that. of the tricks that i know <laughs> that injector mods so we're gonna lower it down a little bit try to get her a little how low are we going oh we're lowering okay well, i like that probably like at least three three four inches uh, in the back so yeah i mean we'll be like doing yeah. pretty good not tucking them but so, we're gonna be close yeah uh, we're gonna put a set of our traction bars on it um probably weld the rear end up so that way i don't you're gonna have the video like you had to bump it in to get it to make yeah. sure the let me slip the grab, so weld it so we want to Whew. And, uh, Yo, how Lincoln many, Locker. How many days, how many days we got? Oh, uh, let's see. It's uh, it's March 4th, so... Uh, 28 days. Less than that, probably. Not much. Not a big deal. Yeah. We got it. We're in the right spot, hey, I think. Got AJ. <laughs> I got it. <laughs> yeah, AJ's got it. No problem, guys. I have an idea for a wrap, but I don't know. It's going to be pretty funky. I don't know. Yeah. And there's some so, theme ideas here. You want to talk about that or I don't not? know. I don't know. I don't know. We want to be able to possibly <laughs> inject something into the exhaust. <laughs> okay. Doesn't make so sense. where's the hood's that going to come out? That's what we need. <laughs> yeah. <to find. laughs> so that's going to be gone. Yeah, this is going to be gone. We're going to bring it around and right there, there somewhere. I think we can inject yeah. some stuff in there. So no problem. I think it'll be pretty easy. Yeah, I mean, well, since the heater box is going to be gone, it'll be a big hole. It'll be a big hole there. So we'll already have the <laughs> access to what we want to do. Maybe like a what Venturi you, you effect. You guys like chuck, chucking hot dogs in the What are you chucking? I mean, I wouldn't worry about it. Yeah, you know, we'll, we'll okay. maybe talk in a second on that. I want to keep it a surprise, though. <laughs> All right. Hey, let's just make sure it goes in the exhaust and not the intake. I'll have to make note of that. Smart. Oh. Got it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, what are you thinking here, well, bud? There's time for uh, more humiliation, I guess. I thought we've gone through enough of that. Um, there's chin ups and pull ups. To me, those are the same because I don't know what I'm doing. But to get on the board, I have to do at least one. Yeah. <laughs> Is chin ups like this we've been doing? Like, okay. So bar, chin. I could probably do a chin up, I'd bet. Pull ups. Out oh, you're this. talking the wide spot. Yeah, that's okay. tough. Yeah, I don't know if you guys have noticed, but I haven't really got the genetics to get shoulders to allow me to do this. So we'll do one. I'll probably show my fupa or something. It'll be not, embarrassing. Not many times does Leo need a ladder, but you know. <laughs> I probably could have jumped up and got it, but that would ruin my strength. Yeah. <laughs> right off the bat, you'd be done. Yeah. Oh, here we go. One. Uh, two. We're giving you two there. I'm not doing it. All right. <laughs> All right. Hey, you're not in Dude, last. I'm, I'm you're not, not in dead so last. You might have to go 1.5 on that. <laughs> I felt like my chin was above it, but my, head, my head's so big, dude. This is like a whole extra pull-up for a normal human. All right. Well, just give me one. I'll take one. <laughs> we'll get you on the board. <laughs> I don't know. It's all right. Like, you can what? do 13? Yeah. 
Okay, since I was humiliated, can you I started, do five? I right started now? with six, and then like we've been, we've been building up to How it. How long so. has this list been around? Uh, about a month and a half. So look here, we got a little thing here. Effective immediately. For every. Oh, in the pooper. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, if that was at my house, I would be doing like 50 pull-ups a day. <laughs> so we're just trying to deter, you know what I mean? So Tom, he sets a timer, four minutes, 58 seconds, he's out. Like, yeah. <laughs> just someone <laughs> keeping Tom with the poops. Right there, there's Tom right there. Right, Tom? Four minutes, 35 seconds, he's done. All right. He can't well, get on What if you go to Taco Bell, though? Like, because you're going to be in there well, sometime. That should be quicker then. Minutes. <laughs> yeah, but there's a lot of cleanup after that. <laughs> oh, you got to do something now, Derek. I can't, yep. I can't huh? leave Joe's without you doing a couple. One, two. You're not going down three. all the way. Uh, he is breaking the 90. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Wow, okay. Yeah, he's actually doing it. Yeah. I'll stop counting. Oh, well, yep, mm -hmm, yep. Mm -hmm. He finished off with a good one, too. That's how you know he's a right. G. Jeez, okay. man. Good job, brother. All right, so here's the deal. DNR Customs, dude, these guys will build what you need. The majority of their stuff is transmissions, like he's talking about, but they can build your dreams, right? Yeah, yeah, six liter, five nine, six seven power stroke. I gotta catch my breath because I'm. I'm putting them on the spot on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, yeah, these guys are hooking us up big time with this burnout truck. So, as we always say, support people that support us. DNRCustoms.com, get all the parts. Yeah, all the okay. stuff. Yep, we had a brand new website we launched last fall and got a lot of good stuff on there. And um, yeah, we'll, we'll take care if you need anything. That's it, baby. That's it. And all these people over here continuing to support us. Absolutely awesome. Our six liter project is just starting. Ugh. The truck's not even rotted, really. I know it. Is it rotted? There's, it there's rotted? some bubbles. It's a little bit, but I mean, it's pretty good. It's not bad. I mean, yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't go field in there too hard, but right. <laughs> this seat's good. But uh, thank all you guys. Frank, what do you got to say, buddy? I mean, come on, guys. You guys know the deal. Come on. It, it is exactly what we need to be at. This is incredible. We love it all. Can't thank everybody enough. I'm excited, dude. Who's gonna do some burnout? You gonna do some burnouts? No, you. You're the you're the diesel guy. I can't do that. <laughs> you can't even drive it? Okay, I no. like that. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't want to drive it, dude. This is you. This is the Frank unit. I know it's gonna look so good too, slammed on the ground. Yeah, that's gonna be badass. <laughs> All right, thank you, Derek. Yep, thank you guys. Bye. <laughs> oh, no, that's mine. Bye. <laughs> All right, Frank just literally did five <laughs> one-arm pull-ups. <laughs> not one-arm. But you had the, the your right hand was just kind of dangling up yeah. there. It's not happy. I'm mean, okay. not going to do it again because he didn't get on camera. Well, you just started doing them, man. What do you want me to do? I do it backwards. Does this count, Derek? Yeah, yeah, it counts. Yeah, I'm going to give it to him. Okay. All right, be careful because you don't have the stem cells in you yet. Two. Three. Four, do six, five, oh. <laughs> hey, good job, brother. She's burning. <laughs>